Superplex there. And Jack can certainly hold again. Oh, Jack here in. we go. Here comes here Johnny. Here we go. Here's Johnny. And you see right now. Judo hip toss. That's how you do it. Armbar locked in. Damn it. The groundskeeper gets in there. Never. Here comes Jack. Never say that again. What? What? That he's Johnny B. Oh. Johnny got a schoolboy. One, two. One, two. Ow. Kick out. But I'm still trying to quest. I'm still trying to figure out why. I can run it there. Got it. Oh, and the groundskeeper again. Breaking the cover. Oh, and that's the one thing groundskeeper's been doing quite well in this match. So far, he's broken up every cover made by Gatton Stanbridge. Which, so which sounds like a shoemaking company. Gatton Stanbridge. I'm guessing... Nah. You, you, need, you need to go back to 17th, 18th century England to really... Ow! Oh! Close line! And the tag made down to the groundskeeper! Daniel the the Bulldog. It's kind of like the sort of things you'd get back in 17th century, 18th century England. Yeah. Shoe companies named after people. Wow. Well, pretty much everything back then was named after people. Pretty much, any, pretty much anything in the world is named after a person. True. And I would say oh. Zinyak is like the Daily Mail. What? Full of crap. Nah, I wouldn't say the Daily Mail's full of crap. Private Eye is de Private Eye is a definite for full of crap. But then again, I say that because. Then again, I say that because Ian Hislop is a right wing individual and I'm a left wing individual. Anyway, you see right now, as I dive back into my political reference, it, my political preferences, you see Groundskeeper Weird I had that Austin Crab and once again now tags in Zinyak. And right now, Zinyak throws into the corner and splash that! And Zinyak certainly bringing all of his weight into that one as he misses that. And Zinyak, he's actually heavier than the Sun. He's actually heavier than the Sun this year. He's the top. I mean, Zinyak is now the tallest guy here and he is 400 pounds. He makes DK look tiny. I mean, yo, he's still not the biggest guy in CXWI history. That was, well, he well weight wise, that was Bowser. I'll I believe. Naga. I believe he. Oh yeah, Onaga. He pi oh yeah, I forgot about. Onaga's Onaga Onaga scale was about 500. Uh, no, he was five. He was 520. Bowser was about. Bowser four, was 400. Bowser at his peak in CXWI was 455. 85. Actually. No, it was 55. It was 55. During the Ball Alliance, we actually weighed Bowser to, and in and in. Oh Naga, really? He was actually 485. Oh. Ah, oh, okay then. Fair enough. Uh, it makes me. Oh my! Seriously, them two made me look tiny. Whoa. Cover! That's us. Because remember, at my peak, at my highest weight was 320. So you I'm now down to about 255. So yeah, you've managed to lose quite a lot. Well, look, wait. Is it by any chance you're on the Simon system? Does no. Any, does anyone remember that? It's more. Of, it was more of a. That was just. Uh, yeah. It's like something Weird Al will come up with. Oh! Shoulder tackle there by Johnny Gat. And Johnny pulls Zinyak off the ropes. I'm thinking Austin Yu has this thinking right now. What? And into a leg lock. Oh, but... Once again, the groundskeeper makes the stop. And so far, the groundskeeper, he's done a pretty decent job of stopping everything. You see Jack right now standing there like a lemon. Now he's moving. Johnny Gat gets thrown into the corner. Tag made to the groundskeeper. Oh no. Oh man, check this out. Hit it there. And Jack tried to... Jack tried to get it. Oh! A low blow. A suplex there. I think... I think we kind of know what the outcome of this match is now going to be. You see right oh, now, the shot right blow. there to the head. You see the ref try to get some restraint. And the groundskeeper right now taking it to Johnny Gat. Oh wait! Oh, roll up! Oh, but didn't even get a one count there. I tried a low shot. That didn't work. Oh, no this! But the referee! The ref was distracted. Wouldn't have been a free count either way. And once again, Jack's standing there. Like a lemon. 
He's still got see. the cuts on his face, which is... What? That's like a, a scar. That's, 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 a that's a tattoo. When did he get a tattoo on his face? He's always had that tattoo. Uh-oh! Nice! Hit him the gap drop! And Tag made now Jack coming back in! And now Jack! Well obviously goes, he's got problems goes with- Go straight for Zidiac! Well obviously! Cause you got- Oh! But I wouldn't have recommended there. trying to lift up Zidiac, that's just like- Of course it was Zidiac who- I mean Jack was- was pretty doomed enough as it was, Zidiac made it worse for Jack Stanbridge. Anyway, you see right now, a ring bell. Ow. Over the head of the groundskeeper. That was effective. Most definitely. You see now. Balancing up on the top. That's a backdrop. Right under the back of the groundskeeper's head. And look at this, he comes in like again. And see that, wait a minute. Ow. Throws him to the corner. I tried to shot that, that didn't work. Johnny Gat going after the groundskeeper. All oh, hell is broken loose again. Oh, that shot there. Ref trying to get some restraint. Trying to maintain order in this one, but easier said than done. Jack Stanbridge uh, once again manages to knock Zinyak down. Well, now, Zinyak, he may be a lot heavier than most of the guys in this match, but... I think he's doubled the weight of... He's dirt he's as far as I know, Johnny Gat is two thirty-five. I believe Jack is around that same weight. The groundskeeper's about two forty-five. And Zinyak four hundred. More than that. No, he's four hundred pounds. Or at I least that's or that's the S or that's the rounding down to the nearest ten, I believe. He yeah, might, I say I say he more be, than that. He might be four hundred he might be four uh, before we know he could be 402.5. But we Oh! Out there. Imagine out that! Imagine him pulling something out of his out of his overalls! Think he was uh -oh. uh -oh. Call that the kilt riser! I think that could be all she Oh but Johnny Gat getting in there. I think that will object groundskeeper will really drill Jack Ryan in his head with once again I say it, the kilt riser. I think he pulled out a comb of sorts, or something. Some sort of utensil he probably uses in the, in the grounds of Springfield Elementary. But anyway, here's Zinyak again. Well, it could have been a sharp bit of glass from a whiskey bottle. Who knows? You know anyway, he's shot here, and Johnny Gap once again trying to get in. I know for a fact groundskeeper Willie drinks, because I've had a... I know. Yeah, I think we all know he drinks. He's Scottish. Yeah, I've actually had drinking, a drink. Drinking there is from the age of five. I've actually had a drink with groundskeeper Willie, which was awkward. Yeah, that is kind of weird. Yeah. Anyway, you see right now... Because I went to a pub and basically groundskeeper Willie... Oh, was crap. Oh, Brain Buster. Busters again. And it's holding him. A second Brain Buster. That's, I think the second one is that was a bit more power into it. I don't... Who knows? I think that... Oh, I... Look at that! Tossing Jack around like a rag doll! Tossing Jack around like a rag doll from Gary's mod. Ow! Drilling him there, spine buster! Johnny Gat, some holding over groundskeeper Willie, but he's got okay, that's not lasting long. So you know, hip toss. The groundskeeper still is holding his own. Oh no, he's not. Johnny Gat is holding it. Splat! No! Oh wait, uh -oh. check this out! Planted him! Nice! Ref trying to get some order in this one! He's gonna go! Oh, he's got the arms up! Is he just barely got the grip? Dango impact! He barely got the grip fully in! Only Seriously. just! Lee. Cover! And yet ref again! The groundskeeper has the ref distracted! And now, uh oh. Oh, wait a minute! I see the groundskeeper now holding him! Just trying try to hold him to give Zidiac time to recover! That didn't work! 
Nicely done there. Now Gat attack made. In. Attack made. In comes Gat. And the first thing he grabs, Singapore came. Oh, oh but did that take it off of them? Oh. Right over the head. He's back up to his feet though. Takes it off him. Oh, it clobbers in. No, you don't think. And ja Johnny Gap. He's gonna go for it. He's gonna go. I think he's gonna try it. This is how he does it. Oh, oh wait. No, he doesn't. Didn't get got out of the way. No. Oh. Seriously, how flexible is? Well, well, he is an alien. Thought I'd point that out. Oh. Uh -oh. Ah, the brain buster to Johnny Gat. Keeps the hold. Another brain buster. And Gat just gets completely. Just run onto his head twice! Oh, what the? And you see now! Oh, I think he's gonna do it. Yep. Yeah. There's the worm. And dropping the fist right over the. Right over the face of Johnny Gat. I think he calls that the earthworm. Really? I'm not too sure. I thought, because... Earth, I thought earthworm was another. I thought earthworm was another thing. Yeah, earthworm, that's what... I thought that was Earthworm Jim. Oh! Yeah. Drilling a there on his I head don't know again. Why he calls it the wor all something I, worm. I... He calls it the s something worm. It, it was either the Earthworm or the Alien Worm. I think it was the he Alien. Might, he might call it the Zin Worm. Could be. I'm not too... It was something worm. Uh -oh. I... And again! Over the head! We need... And I'll cover! I think that's it. Two! Seriously? That is it! I cannot take this guy seriously. For fuck's sake. Then again, he is wearing a... What looks to be a metal-plated glove. Well, metal-plated gloves, that probably plays a part in that. But... It's just not serious! It's just... What the... That's what I think you better take him seriously. Here it was, look at that metal glove right down onto the head. Not to mention all the force of Zinyak's He's more weight. arrogant all than the force of Zinyak's weight coming down. He's more arrogant than the sun. But certainly okay. impressive by the groundskeeper and by Zinyak. What does he mean by that? Well, it should be pretty obvious, actually. Uh, is he swearing allegiance? Oh hell no! <laughs> well, the task is set! Oh, I think Austin if Ewers I, is If pissed. Austin is watching this, he's going to be really pissed off, but... A new scale he has, got, he has got a... He's got to try to find a way around dealing with this now. Alright, people. This will be the official first in-ring appearance for... Dark Forge. A somewhat darker side of the individual that we all know as Justin. Almost like the, um, the Black Rain. What Black Rain is to Dustin Rhodes, Dark Forge is to Justin. Darker persona. Well, 
There 